You. Easy, easy. I, I, I just shaved this morning. Oh, really? You missed a spot. All right, all right. Just calm down. Just give me a chance to apologize. For what? <gasps> that, for example. You sneaky son of a... Ah, uh, 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 watch it. You're in a church. Are you always this charming? Or am I just lucky? Whoa! Ha <laughs> ha Candlelight. Privacy. Music. Can't think of a better place for hand-to-hand -hand combat. Ooh! You fight almost as well as a man. Funny. I was going to say the same thing about you. That's heading a little below the belt, don't you think? No. This is. <coughs> <coughs> Touché. Didn't know you had a kid. Well, he doesn't take kindly to soldiers. Uh, I noticed. Ah, uh, permit me. I'm Phoebus. It means sun god. And you are? Is this an interrogation? I believe it's called an introduction. You're not arresting me? Not as long as you're in here. I can't. Huh. You're not at all like the other soldiers. Thank you. So... If you're not going to arrest me, what do you want? I'd settle for your name. Esmeralda. Beautiful. You're much better than Phoebus, anyway. Good work, Captain. Now, arrest her. Claim sanctuary. Say it! You tricked me. I'm waiting, Captain. I'm sorry, sir. She claims sanctuary. There's nothing I can do. Then drag her outside and- Oh no! You will not touch her! Don't worry. Minister Frodo learned years ago to respect the sanctity of the church. All right, all right, I'm going. <sighs> you think you've outwitted me. But I am a patient man. And gypsies don't do well inside stone walls. What are you doing? I was just imagining a rope around that beautiful neck. I know what you are imagining. Such a clever witch. So typical of your kind to twist the truth, to cloud the mind with unholy thoughts. Well, no matter. You've chosen a magnificent prison. But it is a prison nonetheless. Set one foot outside, and you're mine. Frollo's orders. Post a guard at every door. Oh, don't worry, Jolly. If Frollo thinks he can keep us here, he's wrong. Don't act rashly, my child. You created quite a stir at the festival. It would be unwise to arouse Frollo's anger further. You saw what he did out there. Letting the crowd torture that poor boy. I thought if just one person could stand up to him, then... <sighs> what do they have against people who are different, anyway? You can't right all the wrongs of this world by yourself. No one out there is going to help, that's for sure. Well, perhaps there is someone in here who can. <laughs>